तो पराठा पराठा वॉज सुपर गुड सुपर गुड विद कर्ड स्वादिश स्वादिश पराठा इज ट्रेडिशनल बेसिकली ब्रेकफास्ट आई लव इट यस यस व्हेन आई गो अब्रॉड आई मिस पराठा इन मॉर्निंग ओह सो मच आई लव इट so you can have paratha on daily basis here till you are here yes in india yes, yes i will be happy with that <laughs> <laughs> yes yes got yes. brindavan the paratha then i am happy right 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 yes so like uh, we were talking like and one more thing like i just wanted to know like you apply this tilak huh. this tilak is different from the escon yes there yeah. so can you tell me about this also yes interesting question yeah. uh, you have very interesting questions yeah. thank you for uh, that you welcome um happens that All the sampradays yeah. has a way of tilak. Okay. You know, you see Rudra, uh, Shiva devotees. They put tilak three lines, right, right. one dot in the center. Yes, yes. For Vaishnav, yes. the root, the base tilak of Vaishnav is this U phase. Okay, okay. This Vaishnav. Only this. Right. This is Vaishnav tilak. Yeah. Originally, yeah. all Vaishnav lines were used in this tilak only. Okay. In, including Gaudiya. Okay. And even Ishkon also, I think. They... Yeah, but Ishkon is a story that started. Uh, 60 years ago or okay. 70 years ago maximum right. so this is a new story okay um, i will get the, i will get to that to that point yeah. so all the gaudiyas starting from gauranga mahaprabhu yeah. and for 500 years yeah. have been using okay. this type of tilak only yeah. u shape right. mm? yeah. some traditional uh, brindavan parivar is still using only okay. u shape right um but there was a time yeah. bashnam mela Uh, Gaudiya Vaishnav Mela, yeah. where they met from different parivars, different spiritual families, from Nikananda Parivar, Advaita Parivar, all the parivars were getting together. Okay, okay. But everybody sent tilak. Okay, okay, okay. What happened? Yeah. That day I met you and I started speaking to you about yeah. our Nityananda, and you yeah. will say, "Just wait, wait, wait." Yeah, you, you sorry, uh, you want to have tea? No, uh, pani, 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 pani. 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 Okay. okay. What was? Half of tea? No, no. Okay. okay. So everybody with this, and I am started speaking to you about. Yeah. The glories of my Nityananda Prabhu, and right. you say yes, yes, but wait. Yes. The glories of Advaita Prabhu. I say, uh, all right, but who is your guru? Mm-hmm. And you will say, our guru, 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 real guru is yeah. Advaita Prabhu. I say, ah, oh, you are from the line of Advaita, yes, yeah, and you, ah, oh, Nityananda, ah, okay. of course. So of course we have a little bit different Siddhanta, like understanding. Yes. So this was happening in that meeting, and in that meeting they get to the idea, mm-hmm. in the end of the meeting, that every parivar yeah. will have a special shape of tilak that you can recognize them. Okay. So you will not do offenses, you right. know, on right. Siddhanta right. to speak some things that they will feel annoyed that no, this is not my way of thinking. Right. So they decide to make different. type of tilak so okay. the basic tilak was then the u okay. and one leaf on the okay. nose and the leaf of the nose represent the different parivar so for us okay. in nityananda parivar we have one bamboo uh, bamboo leaf okay. that is basically like a triangle like long right. long leaf okay. long like this okay. in advaita parivar is the other big branch of gaudiya vaishnavism they have same u shape okay. and here a big big it's almost like a heart okay okay, okay. Yeah, big big right. shape of uh, leaf here okay. basically from the main nature tree yeah. of the area of their parivar okay. this is what they choose right. you know right. from our nitya and the parivar was full of bamboo area so they right. put the bamboo line because this is our land okay. our area looks like this right. so every parivar get a different tilak right. then 100 years ago approx our big big master yeah. manifested on earth sri radha raman charanda dev yeah. radha raman is the incarnation of nitya and the prabhu okay. so of course it's nitya and the parivar But in order to distinguish from our Nityananda Parivar yeah. and the Nityananda Parivar that exists in other lines, right. then the difference was to create this shape in this area. But it's not only one line, but it's kind of a triangle. Okay. Okay. So if, if they can see, it's open like this, right? right. A little bit up and like this. Okay. It's like a triangle. Right. And then the triangle of the the nose and the dot. Okay. So this distinguish our tilak. So whenever we see the bodhis, you yeah. know, I see the tilak and I know. from which family they belong so right. i know if they are brother of me yeah. or just cousin um, yes. family members oh, right. far family members i yes. can see by, by the tilak okay 100 okay. 100 years ago they mm-hmm. uh, start a new uh, like a reform like a, okay. some new philosophy came okay that it was called uh, gaudiya mat uh, okay. and the hands of bhakti siddhanta gaudiya mat ah uh, okay. gaudiya mat and it uh, true bhakti siddhanta sarasvati right, right. And he create his own tilak for his own movement. Okay. But it, and this is a tilak that Sri Prabhupada Bhakti, Bhakti Ranta Swami used and Ishkon used. Okay. But this tilak is not the traditional Gaudiya tilak. Okay. It's the tilak that Bhakti Siddhanta created. Right, right. So originally in Bengal, mm-hmm. the origins of uh, Gaudiya Vaishnavism, the tilak is white okay, because yes, they yes. use 
the mold from Ganges. Okay, okay. From and this was uh, like a gray, light gray or white color. Right, right. So all the old Vaishnav in the pictures, yes. black and white from yes. previous hundred years okay. or more, right. you see with white tilak. Yes. Different yes. shape of tilak, yes. but white. Okay. And so Bhakti Siddhanta created this yellow tilak. Uh, sorry to interrupt you, yes. but because like even I also used to think and most of the people, most of the viewers, they are also thinking, it's of Chandan. But you said it is of Ganga, uh -huh. right? Uh -huh. The salt from the Ganga they take and then they put that white tilak, Ji. right? Ji. And yeah, please. And um, yeah, chandan also is used, but normally it's used as a decoration. Normally, the Ch Gaudiya put chandan in this area, right? You know this, but the tilak was made out of Ganga. Oh, okay. you see all the Vaishnavs or yeah. pictures, the tilak is white color, right? Right. Uh, yes, right. So now. Since Vaishnav can travel, yeah. or some devotees from Bengal yes. came to Vrindavan, right, right. they go to Radhakund okay. and they get Radhakund Tilak. Okay, okay, okay. From where the Radhakund Tilak story came, because some yeah. people say, without knowing, they yeah. say, to use Radhakund is not correct Tilak. Okay, okay, okay. Normally in Ishkund they say this, they use this yellow Tilak, okay. that is creation of 100 years ago, no right. more. And it's because when Sri Gauranga Mahaprabhu came to Brindavan right. and he started discovering all the places, here Brindavan was just jungle okay. from that moment, there was nothing here. Right, right. Gauranga worked in this area in his, in, in his divine Lila mind, he saw everything mm -hmm. as the original Brindavan, he said, here is this thing. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. please, please, please. Yeah, here is there this other thing, like mm -hmm. places, like these important places. And when he get to Radhakund, actually, mm -hmm. okay. he discovered Radhakund, oh, this is Radhakund, this right. place. Right, mm -hmm. right. And he went to the water and mm -hmm. take Okay. Yeah, the soil okay. and he put in the his, he made his tilak out of Radhakun tilak. Okay, okay. So based on that, we understand that our tilak yeah. must be Radhakun tilak. Right, right. In the previous generations, mm -hmm. to go from Bengal to Radhakun, right, right, right. yes, too, ma too many days of yes, traveling, yes, so yes. it was not available. Yes. But now we are available, so right. we have this available. So okay. all Gaudijas now right. we are using Radhakun tilak because okay. of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, okay. he used this tilak. Okay, so this tilak is basically black. The tilak of Radha Kunt actually is, is gray color. Gray color, okay, mm, okay. Gray color. Like you are applying, this is a gray color, huh. right? Yes, if you yeah, see. This. Okay, right, right. right. It's a gray color. Gray mm. color. Okay. So yes. when you are traveling, like you are in some other country, in your own country, then how do you manage this? Ah, uh, if I, for example, if I have to go to a meeting or something like mm. kind of official yeah. that you must have some etiquette to go, yeah. I just apply the bindi. Okay, this okay. Shambindi is a specific from our Paribar. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, one of our Siddhas in our line, mm -hmm. disciple of Sri Raman Charandas Dev, yeah. the name is Ramdas Babai Maharaj. Yeah. His story is incredible. When you read the story, mm -hmm. you realize what our perfect Vaishnav is. What is the example? It's okay. incredible, really. Right, right. He was, uh, well, so he said that all of the ones who want to be free from the influence of Kali Maharaj, yeah. Kali Yuga, okay. they must use the black the black bindi. Okay. Okay. So when I am in some situation, because Westerns mm -hmm. who doesn't know yeah. if you come to an office or somewhere yes. with this painting, they will yes. think what anything. You know? yes, yes. So I just put the bindi okay. and they take you out. This guy must be Hindu. Okay, okay. Because they have the idea of bindi, yes. Hindu. Yes. Yes. So I just put the bindi, black okay. bindi, and that's it. Okay. Actually, yeah. my question was a uh, little bit different. Oh. Sorry. Uh, no, 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 no. My uh, question was like, if you are in your country, do you take this mud there to apply this? Ah, yes. 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 Okay. And you are there, like, if the mud is over, mm. then uh, what do you do? Like, you the mud is available outside also? Uh, no, very difficult. Okay. They must have sent from, from Radhakun from India. I have okay. friends there okay, okay, also. Okay, okay, okay. But uh, in case that somebody doesn't have it, for example, it can be even in, in Delhi or yes. somewhere in India, they don't have the proper tilak yes. for using. That is not Gopi Shanda. Yeah, right. Gopi Shanda is a commercial creation, yes, so right. to say, but okay. really. Yes, yes. So if they don't have the real tilak mm -hmm. for applying, right. you can use water. But the water, you must do chant some mantra in okay. the water that it will not be ordinary water but now it's purified water and then would you apply with water mm. it's invisible okay. but spiritually it will be there right, so you right. can do with water also right, right. to do the okay, like okay. this right, right. <coughs> so this is good like if you don't have you can chant mantras and you can yes. apply the water yes, yes so it will also work for this yes it works it yes, works yeah. now of course uh, it is said that the tilak is the proudness of you about your parivar and your guru. Right, so right. at least if I am in Bharat, yeah. you know, I will apply every day my tilak and I will right. do my tilak the best possible way mm -hmm. because I'm very proud. My only proudness in this life is that I get the shelter of my Radha Raman, of my Guruji. Radha so Raman. I show yeah. my parivar, my yes. family, yes, yes, yes. through my tilak. So okay. I do tilak. Right, uh, right. So basically, if you guys are also coming, you can visit Radha Raman temple. Yes. Oh, right? Yes. Now, yes. Radharaman Temple yeah. from um, uh, Radharaman Lal yeah. is 
Mandir Radha Raman. Mm -hmm. When I speak about Radha Raman Charanda's death, it's not the same. Okay, yeah? okay. The Radha Raman Temple, I am very good contact with them. Okay. They are wonderful right, tradition. Right. They are okay. pure Vaishnavs. Yeah, yeah. I, I have many interviews with one of the Goswamis, the okay, okay. Sandan Goswami, okay, okay. very smart, right, a right. pandit, okay, okay. who knows very much. And everything that he say, I am in totally tuned with okay. what he say. Because right. this is a traditional philosophy. In right. different parivar, philosophy yes. is the same. Yes. Oranga Mahaprabhu philosophy. So it cannot be different. Okay, okay. But Radharaman Charanda's death is different line. Okay, 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 different okay. line. Okay. So, yeah. of course, they can go to Radharaman. Yes, yes, I go yeah. any time I have time, I go to okay. have darshan. Okay. But uh, here in Brindavan, there are a few temples, okay. uh, ashrams, okay. temples of my parivar, my okay. line. But they can check for Radha Raman Charanda's death, okay. or they can write Bade Baba. Okay. Uh, Bade Baba. Bade Baba. Okay. Uh, Bade Baba or Bade Baba. Okay. Also, it's writing. Okay. Yeah. So they can find. I right. can give you some link right. so you can put yes. some information there that it will get into that. Right. If somebody is really interested in to learn, if mm -hmm. somebody like to, the, the viewers uh, like to read, mm -hmm. to get inspired through the books, that right. is the best sangha. Okay. Actually, the right. best sangha is to read the story and to be associated with the sadhus right. through the books. Right. Mm -hmm. right. All the siddhas. Okay. Radha Raman is a Mahapurush. Okay. You know, this is a very higher level. Okay. It's beyond siddhas. Okay. You know, Mahapurush. Right. 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 Um, they can find a book. If in English, yeah. it's called Life of Love. Life, Life of, of Love. Love. The writer okay. is Obiel Kapoor. Obiel Kapoor. Ah, okay, you? so you guys can yeah. uh, search on the net also. You can find it out. Yes. Yeah. Obiel Kapoor and Life of Love is uh, yeah. about 400 pages. Okay. The full story right, of right. Radha Raman okay. Okay. The story is incredible. Ah, you know, nice. half of the book you will be super excited. Uh -huh. Half of the book you will be crying really oh, because nice. the story is so beautiful. Okay. So much pureness. Right, right. I was in a different family before. Okay. Okay. I read this. Uh -huh. And I quit. I say okay. I cannot. Right. And you know, I want to surrender to to, to this right. Right. now because so basically you came to Escon first. Back in time, like twenty yeah. years ago, yeah. I was in a similar to Ishkon from the same family. Okay, okay. Of okay. 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 So can you tell me about your journey also, like from where to where? Right. Yeah. Uh, well, originally. Uh, I read the Ishkon books. Okay. I read everything about Bhaktivedanta Swami, Bhakti Swami right. his books, writing, Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad Gita, and I read all, all this study. Right. Right. Done. I associate with devotees from Ishkon okay. in my country, but mainly from an uh, alternative line okay. of Ishkon that opened right. from Ishkon. Okay. Okay. They opened around the eight, uh, year 85. Okay. Uh, since in America and South America and in Europe, mm -hmm. Ishkon has so many problems. Like okay. So many things were happening and many people were very unhappy. Okay. So, so what was the reason basically? Why people were not happy? Well, it's very hard to say, you know, I don't want to hurt any feelings on this, but the reality is, this but is the story. But we know the reality of There were murder, drug dealings, okay. uh, black money laundry, right. abuse on women, raping, okay. kids okay. rape, okay. gurupulas where kids were raped, okay. you know, murder kids keep missing okay. out of pedophiles. Okay. Okay. So, like, super dark story. Okay. So, so who used to do this? The sannyasis, the gurus, okay, sannyasis, the bodhis, the gurus, the bodhis. yeah. So right. that's why some people divided okay. and say we cannot keep supporting this. Right, right. For South America, for America, yeah. back in time, the eighties and a little bit before, after all this darkness came, after Sila, Sila Prabhupada left the body, all right? Okay. There were some people with bad intention right. that cannot act when the acharya was there. Right. So when as soon as he get see, he left the body, mm -hmm. full darkness for okay. some long time, okay. like 10, 15 years was very bad time. Okay. And I encourage anybody, everybody to study because we cannot see only one part of the coin. So yes. after we see the full story, we decide if each one is my line yes. or if I find to find something else. You know, right. you cannot be covering the things. Right. You know? So this happened, and uh, Krishna. And then many people start opening and trying to keep Krishna consciousness, but on a good, good, good way. You know, no, no, with these people behind, leaving, leaving the temples and everything. Right. Right. Know everybody, of course, right. but one of the principal heads that are still yes. were these kind of people. So that's why many lines open from there, okay. and many devotees find try to find shelter in other masters because they don't feel safe, safe and grow enough to keep right. on, uh, yourself working alone. You, know? right. you need company, you need sangha. So many people open, and this was a dark time. Yeah. Things now have been changing quite much, and right. that is very good. And many, yes, yes. I know many beautiful Eastern devotees nowadays. Okay. Very pure in the heart. They yes. are very a lot of effort every day. They they are nice devotees, right, you know. Right. But something happens. Something happened. Yes, it's yes, not, yes. You cannot yes. hide it. You know. Yes, yes. This is the truth. So the, all this happened, and many different branches came out. Right. right? right, right. Of course, 
some people who want power, they use this as an excuse to open new branches and let's get left these gurus behind, they're all these toxic people, yes, yes. now I am the guru, yes, you know? <laughs> that is the thing, everyone is becoming the guru now. Yes, yes, yes. it's a saying, kill the guru, become guru. Yes, yes, huh? yes. So you, yes, yes. And yes. then you are the center. Kill or kick the guru. Ah, yes, 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 yes. So this is a concept and it happened. So I was part of one of those new cults, okay, you know? Okay. We studied Gita, everything. Okay. All the philosophy of Swami okay. Bhaktivinata, we studied the same, okay. but we didn't belong to Islam. Anyway, when I start growing mm -hmm. and I start realizing that the most advanced souls, who are supposed to be the Mahatmas in our line, right. are not Mahatmas at all. Yes, you yes, know. Yes. And many of the true questions that yes. I have in terms of soul, Krishna, yes. spiritual world, etc., yes. they cannot answer. True, true, true. So I start saying, all right. What is happening? Yes, you know, yes, yes. if the gurus cannot answer, they have right. no answer, and if so, they answer, they are like just jumping right, in right. the answer. Nothing, yes, you know. Yes. What? Tatva is tatva. Yes. Tatva is simple yes. and clear, right, right. and it's so heavy that yes. when you get the tatva, it's like this is yes. video. Yes. Right. There are no question. Yes, you know, yes. this is tatva. But they were like tap dancing. We say in English yes. tap dancing. Yes, you know, yes, yes. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Yes, doing yes, a show yes. to explain something yes, because they don't know. Yeah. And I realized this. Yeah, actually, what the meaning of guru? Exact meaning of guru is hmm? guru takes you from the dark, it, the darkness is there, he takes you out of the darkness yeah. and he shows you the way. Ah. Because personally I travel a lot and I have met many people, so I have felt people like many gurus I have met and they are like, we know everything, you don't tell us. Yeah. Right. Yes, yes. And I have an argument with those gurus, if you know everything, answer my questions. Right. And they are not able to answer the question. Uh, uh, yes. Yesterday I had met a guy, he was a guru. He was around 75 years old and he was not able to answer my questions and then he said, you answer my question. I said, if I will answer your question, you need to become my chela, yeah, <laughs> my disciple and I will be your guru. Achha. And then I answered his question and he was like, okay, he was touching my feet. <laughs> now guide me. <laughs> so, this is a lifelong learning process, what I have seen yes. in spirituality. You can, like, you travel, you gather information. And you deliver to people, right? Yes. And the Supreme Guru is one, what I believe. Yes, yes. Supreme Guru is one. Thank in you, thank you In so Gaudiya, yeah. we say the Guru yeah. is Nityananda Ram. Right. This is Supreme Guru. Yes. And right. he expands in different potencies, different deepness right. in all the Gurus that exist in the world universe, in the world creation. Right. But the, Nitai is Balaram, yes. Balaram is Krishna. So right. the power of Krishna is Guru. Right. That's why Krishna say Guru and me is not different. He say in Bhagavad Gita. Yes. And it's true, yeah. but bona fide guru, mm. many people get in the position of guru because they have disciples, free money, free house, yeah. they eat the best, yes, they yes. travel, yes. they worship, yes. it's an ego game. Right. So this ego game you must identify, right. when you realize what really is a guru, yeah. then you will realize. And if guru has no answer for the most basic uh, questions, questions of the disciples, yes. then it's no guru, yes, no yes. real guru. Right. It's right. a Kali Yuga guru, yes, yes. full of desires. No? Yeah. The most basic question is, right. Right. From where I am coming from as a Jiva. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, many yes. will say you came came down from Vaikuntha, you fell down. Yeah. From the perfect world, spiritual world, you came yeah. down, you fell to earth. Okay. Because you have bad desires. <laughs> yes. How can be in a perfect reality yes. you have bad desires? Yes, yes. In perfect reality only are living perfect souls. Right, right. They never fell down. Right, right. True. So gurus are telling this story, they yeah. are not gurus. Yes, yes. They yes. don't know. Yes, you yes. Know? The shastras are clear and explained clearly. Right. You never went. You never went there. Yes. You never came from Krishna. You never met Krishna. Yes, yes. We are doing effort now to meet Krishna. Yes, yes. But once we achieve Krishna, yes, yes. what's possible if you achieve Krishna? Yes, yes, then now you say, "Oh, I want to go to get drunk to material world." Yeah. If you are intoxicated in love in front of Krishna, it's right, not right. sense. Yes, yes, yes. So this is the process. True, true, yeah. true, true, true. Very good. Yes, yeah. And one more thing I wanted to know, like when I met him personally. Generally, people they wear Tulsi Mala, uh -huh. and I was impressed by this Mala. So I said the beats are very big. Uh -huh. <laughs> so can you tell me about this also? Yes, yes. Uh, the goal of Vaishnav or yeah. aspirant of Vaishnav is is Tulsi Mala. Okay. See Kanti Mala okay. and Tulsi Mala. These okay. are our goals. Okay. And since a child, yeah. I have this image in my head mm -hmm. of the yogi yeah. and the yogis. You're right. Uh, in this in my mind, in my head, the yogis, they don't have a special ma machines to make so sophisticated malas. Right, right. So they basically have tulsi or yeah. a sacred wood. Okay. They chop as they can okay. and they put a mala. So right. normally the 
the malas are very big chunk right, you know? right, right. very big yeah. so this is my idea since a child okay. about how yogis are right. how the real gurus were right looking with those, those sadhus who were in the forest doing right, only right. vajra meditation yeah. deeply meditation they look like that yes, you know? yes, with yes. long dreadlocks you know yes yes, yes. Uh, they even uh, a bit scary looking you <laughs> yes, know? yes 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 not, yes. not nice <laughs> very strong you know yes, yes. like mahadev shiva yes you know? yes yes shiva don't use sophisticated things yes, you know yes, yes, like yes. a prince no yes. shiva is yeah. very strong power. Yes, yes, yes. so that's why i have yeah. this uh, attachment that i like yeah. malas okay, okay. strong malas and right, right. you know nowadays yeah. thanks to guruji <laughs> i am a little bit more and the control of that, yes, but normally yes. I, I have very big malas, Tulsi okay. malas. You know? okay. One time I was like, how many malas I am using? Uh -huh. you know? And I say, no, no, no. Right, if right. my guru doesn't use like this, uh -huh. I have to calm down. Right, 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 so I'm right. using now only my country mala. Okay, okay, okay. And, and so it. I can say like little bit of Shiv Roop is also there in you. Huh? Shiv is also there in you. Shiv, Shiv. Shiv, Shiv. Yeah? Is also there in you. You want to be like Shiv. Wait. The big, big malas. Ah, mahadev. <laughs> mahadev, mahadev. Yes. Oh, uh, uh -huh. I always have very much uh, appreciation of Mahadev. Yes, yes. I like, I like his style. Yes, yes. Yeah. Seriously, his style is totally different. He is like very strong. Yes. Yeah. But also very sweet. Very sweet. Yes. 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 He's, 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 he's like he's, coconut. Yes, 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 yes exactly. exactly. Yes. exactly. Coconut is yes. the best example. Yes, 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 yes. I have so much appreciation of Mahadev. Yeah. And I pray to him every day that I will become us strong in my sadhan yes. as he is doing. So yes. please, Mahadev, bless me that I, I can become such a pure devotee right. as you are. Yes. Let me serve you, let me serve all Vajna. Right. So, yes, I see Mahadev, Mahadev, uh -huh. they're full of yes. dust or, yes. or uh, all the, you know, and the tea like, like this, bah, boom, yes, bah, you yes, know? Yes, yes. I'm meditating like yes, yes. any ghost, any demon, any anything will be afraid, yes, you know, yes. only to see. Yes, yes, so yes. I meditate in this power, yes, Mahadev, yes, yes. you know. He has a power, seriously very powerful. Yes, he is, absolutely. Yeah. He is Bhagavan. Yes, yes, huh? yes. He's Bhagavan also. Yes, yes. I'm not saying that this is, is the Swayam Bhagavan, yes, but yes. Mahadev definitely is Bhagavan. Yeah. Because if I will tell you about yoga also, people generally say Patanjali yoga. Uh -huh. So I'm into yoga also and I'm into a little bit of spirituality. So yoga, you know, came from which place? Yoga. Yoga. Well, I can be wrong on this, but I yeah. think yoga is an eternal thing. Uh, basically, it is an internal thing and it came from Shiv. Shiva, yes, Shiva. yes, yes, yes. So, when Sati, you know Sati? Yes, yes. Sati was like, he was searching for Sati and he was not finding Sati and Sati was like, she was not there. Mm. So, he did Tandav. Tandav uh -huh. When he did Tandav, Rishi, uh, this, Patanjali Rishi, mm. he saw him and he wrote the things. Mm. He made the Photographs and everything, pictures, he did. and from that it came to yoga. Uh -huh, right, uh -huh. different different poses were there, different things were there, and from there the origin of yoga came. But generally we think Patanjali Rishi has created yoga, but it was done by Shiv. Shiv, yes, yes and yes. it was scripted by Patanjali, and uh -huh. now we are following that. Yes, also there in in this tanda. They were manifest all the Bija mantras. Yes, yes, the mantras yes, came yes. from that. Yes, yes, yes. yes so yes. many devotees. Uh, then yeah. get back to the same. Okay. So we are planning some retreats also. It will be a spiritual retreat, yoga retreat, and we will be exploring on bike. So yeah, this is what we spoke earlier when we met for yeah. first time to maybe to make some trips to Himalaya. Uh, this can be of course a spiritual retreat. So it will be a great idea if many of you will join us and to go to Himalayas we can make it on bike the ones who have no bike well in bus anything, yeah, anything. Mm -hmm. but the important thing will be that we can get together to do some meditation and I'm telling what I have been telling now on camera is 10% of the real thing yeah. what is Bayan what is meditation smart and all these things I can explain in person yes, and it's yes. much more rich when you can yes. train and practice with other right, people right, yeah. right and it will be good like if we can we'll connect with people and we can have the Himalayas also will be yeah, there. Beautiful, yes. Tracking, we can do some tracking sort of yes. thing, yoga, and most important, the spirituality. Yes, yes. So yes. that can be part of that. Let's do it. Yeah, we can exchange the things. What, like, you have the knowledge in spirituality, what I have the knowledge in yoga, basically. So, combination of Super. everything, yeah. That would be great, yes. yes. And spirituality is basically yoga. Yes, yeah. yes. If you combine yoga, yoga is basically Atma, Paramatma. Yes. The Atma ka milan paramatma se, mm. right? So you connect with the divine supreme power. Yes, yes, yeah. through, through your yeah. practice. Yes. yes, 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 yes. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. yes, Sounds yes, right. yes, yes right. we can, yeah, yeah. Yes. We can plan it. So if people are interested, they can contact us. 
either on his channel either on my channel anyway so we will be connected to, together yes yeah yeah super yes super. thank you very much thank you